This is an art room. This is an art room. And with a few basic tools, this is an art room. You're watching The Art Room. <laughs> I get really excited to make some art, and I get my paper and my pencils all ready, and then I can't think of anything to draw. At times like this, I like to check my favorite free art supply store, the recycling bin. Let's go take a look. Let's see what we can find back here. Whoa. I think there's something moving in there. What's this? Hey! Whoa! What do you think you're doing? Oh, uh, hi there, Mr. Rat. Uh, I'm Zach, and who are you, and what are you doing in my recycling? Your recycling? Hey, Buster, if it's in here, it's fair game. The name's Ricky. They call me Ricky the Recycling Rat, and I am an artist. I've even got my own gallery. You have your own gallery? Well... Where is it? I'd love to come by sometime. It's just in your front window. Come on, I'll show ya. Hey, uh, Ricky, where'd you go? Ah, uh, here I am. Oh, there you are. Where, uh, where's your gallery? Well, it's actually just right behind us. If you just move the curtains out of the way, oh, we'll, uh, okay. we'll be able to see it. Okay. I just set it up here the other day. I finally made enough sculptures to have a proper art show. And I'm having my first big opening next Thursday. Wow, that's so cool, Ricky. Look at these sculptures, they're amazing. What's this one? Oh, well that's my spinning wheel. Wow. Yeah? Basically, you just have to move it and try to see the whole picture. You just sort of pull on those strings there. Look at that. That's really neat, Ricky. Cool. And, uh, what about this one here? Oh, well, uh, that's the face bowl. It's basically uh, telling the story of uh, the four-dimensional social overmind. Ricky, thanks so much for showing me your gallery. You know, I've really got to get back to my show. Say, you wouldn't want to help out at all, would you? Well, uh, that depends. Would you be saving me any of your recycling? Sure could. Oh, well, I guess it's a deal then. All right, let's go. Do you ever get a great idea only to discover that the materials you need have just been taken out in the recycling? Art Supply Box to the rescue! Decorate a regular cardboard box and use it to store and organize all your favorite materials for making arts and crafts. And welcome back to the art room. And I'm joined by Ricky the Recycling Rat. Say hi, Ricky. Hi there, kids. I'm Ricky the Recycling Rat. Today, we're going to be making a one-word journal jar. A one what? What what? <laughs> it's a one-word journal jar, Ricky. It's just a jar that we decorate on the outside, and every day we try and remember to write down one word. It can be anything, a feeling or a color, or an emotion, and we put that into the jar. And after a couple weeks, when there's a good number of words in there, we can actually start using the words as inspiration for making art. What I have here is an art making checklist. You can make one like it, or download and print one from the website. There are eight different forms of expression, or kinds of art, sculpture and dance for example. Choose a different type of art to do each time until you've done all eight. All right, let's see now. Today I feel rushed and productive. I'll write rushed on a little piece of paper and put it into the jar. I tell you what, Ricky, why don't I leave the jar with you while I'm in Mexico 
and every day try and remember to put a word in it. And when I get back, we can pick a word out and make some art with it. What do you say? You can count on me, Zach. I'm Zach, you're watching The Art Room, and I'm in Mexico at Mis Casas, which is a mini eco-resort. These are owners Katarina and Kim. Hola! Welcome! <laughs> Thank you. And let's have a look around. Okay, Perfect. our pleasure. Yeah, this is a mystical animal garden. And all these pieces of bamboo come from the from the sea. This is the double-headed horse. I'm gonna hit that one. Oh, that guy! I think he's an anteater. You know, because anteaters have those big snouts. You see, there's his eye hole right there. There's a snout coming down. So you want me to paint a mural in one of the apartments? I totally want that. Yeah? I totally want that. Awesome. And catch the spirit of the land and the animals and the fact that I have a guitar but I don't play. <laughs> the musicians come, they like it here. Okay. So what kind of things were you thinking to have in the mural? Well, we're in the jungle, so palms and geckos and scorpions and lizards and birds and because this is Drew's department, she would be insulted if she wasn't in the picture. Right. So you gotta have some cat somewhere. And this whole land is just magical and it's inhabited by young mischievous spirits called Bagosh. Cool. So they gotta fit in there somehow. Okay, great. And then the rest is up to the energy that you pick up from here. Okay. Good. Alright, thank you. I've thought about what Kim wanted for the mural, and I've done a bunch of sketches, and I'm ready to show them to Kim. And it's sort of an underwater, land, space mix of everything. That's amazing. You like it? I love that. Okay, cool. So I thought, well, what if I have the cats all playing instruments? Oh, that's precious. That's precious. Yeah. Here I am in the kitchen of the Jersey apartment. I'm showing Kim and Catherine the sketches for the mural. They like them a lot, so I'm gonna get started. That sure was fun. And it's good to be back too. Well, I wonder where Ricky is, how he's doing, and how his art show went. 
And if you remember to put a word in the one word journal jar every day. Ricky? Ricky? Oh, hey. There you are, Zach. I didn't hear you come in. How was your trip? Did you get that uh, mural of yours painted? Oh, I sure did. Have a look for yourself. Holy Tyrannosaurus! Would you look at that? That's really something, Zach. Thanks, Ricky. I had a lot of fun doing it, too. Hey, d did you remember to put a word in the one word journal jar? Oh! I did, Zach! Thanks. I've been waiting for you to get back to pick one out and use the art forms checklist. Oh! Oh! And look! Oh, wow, Ricky. That's great. I even pinned the checklist to an empty cereal box so we can spin. That's awesome. Nice one, Ricky. All right. Well, let's pick a word out of the jar. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Turquoise. Hmm. Okay. Hey, you said I could write down any word to describe how I was feeling and even a color. I did say that, Ricky, and I think it's a great word. It makes me feel tropical and excited and calm in a really happy way. I think it's an awesome word. Well, do you want to take the wheel for a spin here? Oh, sure. Alright, Ricky, you ready to do the turquoise dance? Let's go! Well, we're back at home, and this is the dance floor. I mean, art room. Thanks for watching, everyone, and we'll see you next time on The Art Room, where any room can be an art room. So long, kids. See you next time. Till I walk out the door and it's 9 06. I used to never be late. I never missed a date. I was a punctual wizard, always on my great escape. But lately, I've been learning to procrastinate. Things seem to go smoother with a lower heart rate. You're gonna hurt yourself You're going too fast Too soon You're going too fast Better mellow out your mind You're going too fast You better stop